welcome back to another video. In today's video, um, I'm going to be spilling some tea on Arcadia Isle. This might be a shorter video because I only have a little bit of tea to share with you guys and I was like deciding whether or not to post on the community tabs and I was like, you know, what? I'll just make a video because it's been a while since I've uploaded a video and I've just been super busy doing like interviews, like job interviews and such like that. I'm looking for a job or actually looking for a career because I am done with college if you guys didn't know and I'm just in that time period where I'm looking to start my career somewhere and get my foot in the door so that's kind of what i've been doing but anyways guys um i have some tea and as you guys can tell by the title today's video is going to be about sea pets that may be coming to overlook bay in the arcadia update if you guys are new to the channel make sure to hit that subscribe button and let's go ahead and head on to twitter So this is the new pet shop that is going to be coming to Arcadia Isle, I believe. Um, let's see. So Wonderworks Studios tweeted a new pet shop, as you guys can see. So let's go ahead and zoom into the picture. And as we can see, this pet shop is underwater. So I'm kind of curious how we are going to get to this pet shop. If the whole island is going to be underwater or we have to go underwater that is near the island if that makes any sense to get to the pet shop i have no clue um i don't remember seeing this building in the arcadia map so this might actually be underwater we'll see on friday by the way guys i do plan on going live on friday so make sure you are subscribed and also have your notifications on because i'm also going to be allowing you guys to join my game um so Stay tuned for that. But as you guys can see in the picture, on top of the pet shop, we can see these pets right here. There's three new pets right here. Um, this is a pink seahorse, and then we also have a regular crab. If you guys didn't know, we also had a molten mines crab. It was like the crystal crab. It was gray with like crystals on it, but this one's just like a regular basic crab. And then we also have a dolphin pet right here. And the reason why I think these are going to be going into the game is because they've already been modeled you know what i mean and um i don't think they would share this if there wasn't going to be any sea pets so i'm kind of curious to know what all these other pets are going to be guys i'm really hoping for a hermit crab pet as you guys can see there's a seashell right here what if there's going to be like a little crab that pops out of it like a hermit crab i think that would be a really cute pet to add to this update so hopefully we'll be seeing a hermit crab pet of course with overlook bay releasing like sea pets there's been a little bit of of like you know controversy with adopt me because they had their sea egg or ocean egg type of thing and in the ocean eggs there was a seahorse also a crab pet and a dolphin pet and i just want to say like <laughs> i love both adopt me and overlook bay i think they're amazing games um i just don't like how you know certain communities will attack another community because they kind of have similar pets and stuff like that and they'll say like that it is copying adopt me and stuff like that i just don't think that is fair and, and i also just think that no game owns a pet like for example did adopt me completely create the pet crab or did adopt me one day just find a crab and was like i'm going to name this a crab no they did not they didn't they aren't the reason why these pets exist and so that's why I want to say like they don't own these pets and I'm not like trying to take sides or anything I just think that it's kind of dumb how there's like fights and stuff um I just I'm that type of person who likes to get along with everybody and I just don't think that those fights are necessary I really do enjoy Overlook Bay's pets though because they are a little bit more creative they're not just basic and stuff like that um that's why I I appreciate Overlook Bay a lot for their pet creations because it's not just like a crab or something for example the crystal crab it was so cute it was like a mix of like crystals and stuff like that and it was a crab and it was really cool to see you know it's not basic um but like these ones of course are going to be a little bit more basic because this is kind of like an island paradise sea update that is coming yeah but this is the first bit of sneak peeks that i have i think i have another one okay so yeah um they haven't tweeted anything else the last time they tweeted was yesterday actually 
um, I think, yeah, that was yesterday. So um, that was the last thing that they tweeted was a new pet shop. All right, guys, so I am on Moondust Bree's um, Twitter page. And if you guys didn't know, Bree creates a lot, actually almost all of the pet concepts for Alluric Bay. Um, this is cute. Look at that. Like literal. Oh, those are the peachy pet. How cute is that? It's like in cereal and stuff. Those look like donuts. <laughs> Anyways, guys, I wanted to show you guys her page because this is a seahorse pet concept that she created for Winterwork Studios. And as you guys saw in the last picture I showed you guys of the pet shop this was one of the pets that was on top of the ceiling or the roof and I can tell you that this is most likely going to be a new pet that is going to be in the update there's gonna be 25 new pets coming to the Arcadia Isle and I'm really excited and I strongly believe that this is going to be one of the pets and as you guys can tell um, from the vibe of this um, a lot of the pets are going to be sea pets and she actually posted another pet right here um this is a jellyfish which we've already seen the model for um i shared this in my last video where um i talked about everything that is coming to um arcade isle some things didn't make it in the video because these are tweeted after but guys look at this wait Hold on. Oh, this is the pet concept for the house that I showed you guys. A little seashell home concept for Wonderworks inspired by Polly Pockets. Oh my goodness, no way. I don't remember having like a Polly Pocket set up like this. Um, comment down below if you guys used to play with Polly Pockets when you were little. Um, I used to play with Polly Pockets. I loved, I love, love, love Littlest Pet Shop. I had almost a huge collection of like the pets and stuff. I didn't have all of them, but like I had most of them and i wish i kept them um i don't have them today unfortunately but i think that's really cool so this is the house concept that we've seen earlier um that was really cool so as you guys can see we've been getting a lot of like sea vibes and we can strongly assume that there is going to be a few sea pets um possibly other type of pets as well i don't know if they're all going to be sea pets but i hope to at least see the hermit crab pet that we talked about earlier because i think that would be super cute and unique and i don't think that any other game has that type of pet yet so i hope to see that maybe one with like flowers on the shell like a purple shell and then we have like flowers going down it or roses i think that'd be so cute Cute, kind of inspired by like the Easter corn how the Easter corn I think is the Easter corn yeah yes yeah, Easter corn that has like flowers going down in its hair and stuff it's so beautiful but yeah this is practically all of the evidence and tea that I have to show you guys that we will be getting some sea pets um I know that a lot of you guys probably don't have a Twitter I wanted to share this tea with you guys just in case you don't have a Twitter so that you guys also get the tea spill so yeah <laughs> All right, guys, so that is going to be the end for today's video. I really hope that you guys enjoyed. Make sure you guys are subscribed so that you can also join my live stream on Friday. This is going to be a big, big, big update to Overlook Bay, and I do not want to miss live streaming it. So thankfully, I am actually free this Friday. Um, whenever they um, choose to release the update, I'm going to be free, and I can't wait to live stream this for you guys because it's going to be awesome. And also, I really hope to meet more of you guys if i haven't met you already i met so many of you guys you guys are so sweet and also thank you to everybody who's been wanting to donate pets um i've been so busy lately i have been barely on roblox i usually play roblox at night now because that's the only time i've that's the only time when I have time to play mostly so um thankfully I am free on Friday so I can't wait to meet more of you guys also make sure to hit the subscribe button if you aren't already subscribed I would love to have you part of our donut squad I love you guys so much and I will see you guys next time bye